Hey everybody, I'm Not Great, and welcome to another episode of the Chrono Cross Radical Dreamers Edition Let's Play. Uh, when last we left off, we were in the Dead Sea, being visited by ghosts of different games. Oh, it's an, it's an Energon thing. Or Enertron, there we go. Am I? HP restored. Status abnormalities removed. But you're still hungry. Oh, yeah. That takes me back. Don't want to fuck with these kids yet. Can I? Oh, nope. Alright. I can't get by to that chest without fucking with the kids, so... Shit. Here we go. Alright, first we need to go get that other chest. <clears throat> A screwy dress. Oh, okay, that's actually really, that's pretty good. For sure. I know the Energizer suit slowly recovers HP, but it's too slow. It's a couple of HP per attack that she does, so... Not terrible, but not great. And a Hellbound. Alright, here we go. This must be lean square, or what's left of it. We got a Marley. We got a Luca. We got a Chrono. Eighty-one thousand. Nadia's bell. May our prayers for peace ring on for eternity. Well, not not so long as eternity. It looks like. But Nadia's bell will never be heard again. Never. Hi, Luca. We... no. Everyone worked to save the planet's future for nothing. It's all because of you. You killed it! You! So many lives were supposed to be saved. This planet was to be healed with love, hope, and dreams. There's Nadia, or Marley, whatever. How could you? How could you do such a thing? It's all your fault that the world is going to end up like this. It's all your fault, Serge. Murderer. Uh, who did I, who did I murder? Who are those children? It is Herr Serge's fault that the world will end up like this. Don't let it bother you. It's just a distant echo of those long gone. It's just an illusion. Who said that? Oh, hi, Miguel. I mean... Yeah, welcome to the Tower of Geddon. Time Crash Ground Zero. It's been a while, Serge, but... I guess you don't remember who I am. I don't blame you. You were only a little child back then. I'm Miguel, a friend of your father. According to the time outside, it's been about 14 years since the night of the storm. What is this place? Glasses push. I don't know, but I don't think we're supposed to know about it. That child. That wounded child. Bring him to me. What was that? Who's there? 
Wait, Wazuki, where are you going? There's no way we can set sail again in this storm. We don't have a second to waste, or else Surge will... But... I don't care what lies ahead of us. I'm going. There's no way I'll allow my son to die without a fight. I'd appreciate it if you waited for me here. Thank you for coming tonight, Miguel. Thank you. No, wait! Wazuki! Yes, I've been here in this very place for 14 years. It wasn't like this when I got here, though. An incident that occurred 10 years ago transformed it into the Dead Sea. Didn't you know? There's nothing in the world as ruthless or impartial as death. All living matter ages over time and eventually dies, no matter how mighty or tiny its life force. So being alive means you're creeping closer to death with every second. God, so uplifting. Fills my heart with joy. But there's none of that here. No one and nothing ages. Nothing wastes away. But all the things that we killed. This quiet, boundless, and beautiful world. An ideal world, straight out of a fairy tale, isn't it? A place and time that belongs to no one. Res nullius. It's because of this. It's because this is a future that was eliminated. By, by what? History is composed of choices and divergences. Each choice you make creates a new world and brings forth a new future. But at the same time, you're eliminating a different future with the choices you didn't make. A future denied of all existence because of a change in the past. A future that was destroyed. <laughs> Even before it was born, rest here. Condensed into the Dead Sea. How was that possible? Fate. Our lives are governed by fate. Fate knows all and controls all. No one can run from fate. Even your presence here was predestined long, long ago. Wouldn't you all like to become one with this world? I don't know what that means. To be a part of eternity? How about it, Serge? You need no longer struggle alone, nor fear an uncertain tomorrow. Well, what do you say? I refuse. I see. Guess there's only one thing left to do then. Are you gonna try and kill me? I take it you're trying to restore the dimensional distortion? If you defeat me and liberate this place, the distortion will return to the way it was. Ah, oh, fuck. We gotta kill our dad's best friend. I guess this is it. Just as there are times of peace, there are times of war. You don't have to hold back. Attack me with all your soul if you wish to live. Let fate take its course. Oh, it's still even the the sad music too. <clears throat> Alright, Sprig, you start. Anti black. Oh no. Alright, I'll just beat the shit out of you. Strong-minded. Uh-oh. Yeah, can't beat a critical hit like that, can you? Ah, oh, Miguel. Weak-minded. No, no, okay, that's fine. You just keep casting those elements. Holy dragon fuck. Ow. Shit, I need to use some fucking elements. Alright. First, I need to revive. The field effect is white, so it should be a full heal. 350 or... Uh, not full, but I'll take it. And... We'll do strengthen on screen. And then we'll go whack, whack, whack. Whack, whack. Oh, come on. Oh, that wasn't too bad. I can work with that.
already black. Oh, fuck. No fair getting the double cast. We're going to fast forward mode. Oh, I got my black elements back. I guess I can just do a cure plus on myself. God damn it, stop it. Uh, let's see. We're in a good spot. We can do... Um, let's do an aqua ball. Bloosh. Oh, shit. Oh, is Link's fatigued? Hey, hey, no, no, ah, dude, ass. All right, we'll go straight for the revive, which is right there. At least he casts his own black element, but still, that's gonna smart. Earthquake, frog friends, blah blah blah, deluge. Alright, now we'll do a recover all, because we really need it. I don't even have black elements. What the fuck is wrong with you, dude? Shit, he's powering up again. <laughs> Launch Miguel up into the fucking sky. Tired of your shit, Miguel. Oh, no. Oh, no. We're gonna jump over to Arenes. I swear I gave her a yes to recover all. Nice. And then over to Lynx. We're gonna focus on lighter attacks. Shit. I am glad I got that heal off. Oh, uh, uh, let's see. You have a cure plus. So let's put that on the sprig. Stop it. Oh, shit. Come on. Um, defend? Defend? Defend. Oh, no. Oh, no. No! I'm all out of... All right, well, it's time to murder your ass, then. Well, let's see. Electro Jolt. You don't seem like the kind of guy who likes to be electrocuted, so... We'll run with that. Hey. Oh, 
Photon Beam, Photon Beam. Alright, let's... Fuck Miguel up. There we go. Growth level up. Damn it, no stream. All right. Dreamer's bandana. All right. No, Miguel. Why? Well done. That's the way, Surge. My, you have grown strong. Maybe. Just maybe, you and your friends have the power to defeat fate and build a new future for humanity. It has seized the true form of this planet's future. That's right. At one stage, our world was on the verge of such inevitable destruction. That was in 1999. Wow, that's been a while. <laughs> when the parasitical alien life form known as Lavos awoke. After centuries of feeding off this planet, Lavos fell from the heavens a countless number of years ago and burrowed deep beneath the surface to eat and sleep. Slowly, but deliberately, Lavos devoured our planet from the inside out, waiting for the time to ripen for its true awakening. Finally did Lavos awaken and manifested its true form on the surface of the planet in our world faced a death from which there seemed no possibility or escape. Of escape, right. Were it not for a teenage boy and his group of adventurer friends, that is. These young heroes caught a glimpse of this planet's future destruction as it appeared in the year 2300. They realized they could not turn their backs on our planet, even if its death would not be anywhere near their lifetime. Time traveling from epoch to epoch, or epoch to epoch, Whatever. They battled Lavos for the future of our planet, and eventually won. But in saving our planet from the death Lavos was going to bring about, they also changed the course of history. Hi, Luca. At that very moment, this whole future time axis ceased to exist. Call it cause and effect. It is just a problem of possibilities, after all. In this world, there are no such things as absolutes or certainties. Hi, Marley. But the future that was supposed to have disappeared is about to be restored here. The future destruction of our planet is going to become a reality in this world once again. Is he gonna talk? Yes. The vengeance of the future we killed is about to begin. With Surge serving as the trigger. Perhaps... Or perhaps not. Either way... It's all part of the grand game of the gods. People are dragged into playing this game, forced to put their own lives on the line, without even knowing the rules. Without even being allowed to complain, they try to do their best under the conditions placed upon them. The only alternative is to give up and leave the playing field. Three years ago, members of the Akashia Dragoons from Termina visited here. Those nice were after the frozen flame, of course. But instead, they became salt for the Dead Sea. You see, only the Chosen One can approach the flame. Where's this flame at? Looks like fate has made its decision and has started to carry it out now. Doesn't want the frozen flame to awaken in this place at this time. It would choose to destroy the flame along with the whole Dead Sea than to allow its enemies to take hold of the flame. Oh shit. This lost future is about to disappear into the darkness beyond the dimensions again. You have no time to spare. You must leave here immediately. Quick! Go! Do I have to go quick? Necessarily? I love you so much. Who said that? That is why I sometimes desire to smash you to bits. What the fuck? Don't worry about me. You must go now. Farewell, Surge. The future is yours for the taking. You, the one that the Frozen Flame has chosen. Okay, bye. 
my dear Lena. May you live in a happier tomorrow. Oh, I should have brought Lena with us for this one. Fuck. Yeah, Miguel's Lena's dad. Bye, ghosts. <laughs> Lean, like Queen Lean, Lena. Wonder if there's a connection there. We are not going to make it. Grab hold, sons of man. That was a dragon. This is a cutscene. Look, I never got that treasure that you need that, that card for, damn it. Never even got the card. Shit. I don't think I have to worry about that anymore. I uh, know. Where the fuck is this? Why did you help us? I too would like to witness this. How thou shalt live, and how thou shalt die. If thou art planning to bring forth a new entity, prepare thyself for anguish and sorrow. What? Where the fuck am I? Oh, it's the cave. Okay, except the, the back end got blown off. The Sea of Eden. Thou intendest to defy the goddess of fate. Speak with the ancient dragon gods who sit in repose in El Nido. Let the path to the Sea of Eden be known when all the powers of the sleeping dragons are brought together. Dragon hunting time! Yay! Sergis, you're concerned about the overworld. The other. other world, ain't you? There we go. God. Got really British really fast. The dimensional distortion should be back in order. Let's head to Opasa Beach. Oof. Oh, we're at Marbule. Okay, that's where he dropped us off. Hey, what's that thing that we forgot to do the other episode? That's right. Save! Um, let's see, what can I do, what can I do, what can I do? There's Gaia's, or Gaia's Naval. This is Sky Dragon Island. Um, there's the Earth Dragon Island. Yes, I do, Termina. Or not Termina, Arna, Arnie Village. Fuck words. Words are hard. Let's see, is there anything else that I can do here? I don't think so. Hmm. I don't know what happens if I try to go back, though. So. Yeah, we'll fast forward over there, we'll see what, what happens. If it just, like, blacks us out or what. Oh shit! Bait distortion? Distortion. And a fate distortion. Um, shit, let's see what happens. I have totally forgotten. This light be a wormhole? But the amulet is not responding. Alright, um, what about this one? Well, fast forward. This light be a wormhole, but the amulet is not responding. Okay. Okay. Well then. Bye! Yep, we're never gonna get that item that you need that pass for. I guess that's fine. Uh, before we leave, 
We'll head to the bend of time. And fast forward again. Weird video glitch, that's fine. Now we got more of these things up, so... Where are you taking me? Oh, okay. Fight the yellow dude. Um, I totally forgot to heal, so we're gonna do that real fast. Just for Sprig. where we go farming for sprig stuff. All right, how about over here? Oh, neat. Okay. We already have one of you, though, so... You can bugger off. I don't like it when... Oh, I'm not here. Aqua Beam. When the field is not in my favor. Boop. this place. Oh, okay. I already have one of these guys, too. talk to squid boy okay never mind then let's get out of here yeah I guess it's a uh, time to head back to the other world unless we want to try and push through and get draggy all right arenes Well, they're Norris on. And... Hmm. I don't think we need Sprig right now. But we do need to swap some things up. So, who haven't I fought with? Sneff. Cool. Uh, let's see. Elements. Allocate. Evolve. Ureens. Evolve. Alright, which one of you two motherfuckers has the highest magic? 14 and 13. Wow, neither of you. Cool. Cover all at the regular power. There we go. And give you a level three revive.
Why not? Gravity blow. Graviton. Minus one. Uh, no. God damn it. I have one, two, three, four spaces left, so that was the wrong thing. Norse is yellow. Oh yeah, let's pop Nostrum in there. Oh, we did have a holy light trap. God damn it. Uh, let's see. Let's give you anti green. Hmm. Nope, that's too that's too bullshit. Oh, he doesn't have any white stuff. Okay. Sure, why not? All right, Sneff, you're up. You're also yellow. Well, ain't that some shit. Yeah, we're gonna get the the cheeky thing on there. Uh, no, that's stupid. One, two, three, four, five. All right. There we go. And a heal. Have a gun. All right, Mithril helmet. Let's 
Switch you off and battle with your element power. Increase by one. Not bad. Oh, and it works with... Oh, nice. Okay. Um, we'll make Norris our dragon guy. And then Snap will make our magic guy. Yeah, as his strength is, is in the fucking tank anyway, so... There we go. Anything raise magic attack higher than that? Nope. Okay. Well. It'll be what it'll be then. See if we can forge anything that will help any of those people. Oh, okay, I don't have that particular mineral yet, so. Alright, well. Armor, we can start getting some sewn stuff going. All right. Fast forward. Here we go. It's back. So this is the dimensional gate. Let's get going. Okay. I, I want... Stop it. There we go. Fast forward. Ah! Um. Ah! Uh um. Go away! Shoo! -hoo! Leave me alone! Oh, look. Death kitties. Huh? Uh, 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 uh. What's going on? Ah! Boy, am I in a major fix. Be gone, demons, if you value your lives. We'll take you on. Um, should we, should we, should we fight this guy? What's going on? Let's get the fuck out of here. Mm, pardon me. Phew, you saved me. Thought you were bad guys, too, from the way you look. I was looking for rainbow shells and those things started harassing me. But look, I got the shells all right. I better head back and give them to Kiki. Thanks a lot for saving me. Okay, bye. Oh, wait. Hey, mister, you should be careful, too. Lots of monsters are on the loose nowadays. All the grown-ups say it's a rebellion led by Surge. Fuck. And I, and I heard this Surge is trying to kill everyone on the island. I can't believe that someone would want to do that. I wonder what's going to happen to us. Okay, bye. Things seem pretty chaotic here. A revolt led by Surge? Is Surge siding against the people? Uh, let's go find out. Gotta track my own ass down. Uh, let's check out Arnie Village, I guess. Oh, look. This cart is unguarded. I got a rainbow shell. <laughs> uh, who are you? Hey, man, sorry. Only residents of Arnie are allowed through here. They're all taking shelter from the evils of Surge and his minions. Well, fuck. Alright, whatever. Um. Oh shit, I forgot to talk to the pot back home. Ah. Oh well, whatever.
Let's see what the other world Hydra marshes are like. Or I went the home world. No, it's the other world. It should be poisonous, if I remember right. Yeah, poisonous. Everybody poisoned? Well, it's not hurting that bad. You guys doing a walk around these marshes in such light clothing? Damned amateurs. Don't expect me to save you when you die of poisoning. What are we at? Ah, uh, we're still fine. Shut up, dude. I got a tablet. Yay! Eh. Alright, we're not supposed to be here yet. We don't have the right clothes or anything, so we're just gonna beat it out of here. Oh, we got a tablet! Do I need to use... Okay, no, it's not permanent. Or it's not poisoning poisoning, it's just, it hurts. So, eh. Fuck it. Oh, something's going on in the Fossil Valley! Ooh, it's an evil kitty. Oh, that was lame. Blah, 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 blah. Whack. That was also lame. You guys suck. Check out Norris's sun shower. A rain of bullets. Why not? Such an innocuous name for raining hell down on people. That's not bad attack power. I was expecting way worse. Neff is getting the shit knocked out of him right now. But Norris has the magical power of gun. See what shit this is. Ah, all right, fine. Let's knock around the Tutan Shamans. Norris casts bullet. And seriously, who needs elements when you have? gun. That seems a little, um, a little one-sided. God damn it. See, look. I summon the power of gun. Alright, I'll stop making, I'll stop making that joke. Oh, I got burns? What the fuck? I can still fight this thing. Should 
should not take long. Ooh, bird. Your weakness is... Bullet! Wow, okay. <laughs> I mean, I know I'm... I'm way over-leveled. <laughs> Stand back, everybody! I've got a gun! Jesus Christ! <laughs> Alright, we'll go down here, too. Oh, hey, kitty. I don't even care, it's just fucking sniff. Alright, what have you got, sniff? HP shuffle, reorder the digits so that pick up your HP value. You know what? Fuck it. Oh well we got Yeah, fuck it. Let's see what let's see what happens. Nothing happened. Did he really just choose the same number? <laughs> Alright, we'll check out Norse's level 3 Spiral Ray. Ship trap. Ooh, nice. <laughs> um, I really should allocate the traps, so. That one's gotta go there. Inferno has to go here, so I'll. I'll replace. Where are my traps at? There they are. We'll do a holy light trap, why not? Uh, yeah. All the traps I got. Come on. Come. Oh, he got me. How 
about big deal. Swiftly and forcefully throw your pack of cards. All right. Sure. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> it just seems so out of place. <laughs> Norris is over there with his gun, but we've got, like, Sneff with cards, we've got people with staves. we've got this, like, Swallow that Lynx slash Surge is using. Like, all manner of shit. Like, people with, with staves and swords and, you know, even just, like, throwing essentially rocks at people. And then Norris. Gun, bam. All right, you people. Um, what the hell's going on? Why, well, Commander Norris? Thank you for your trouble. Currently, we have suspended all economic activities in Termina. We have left only the element shop alone, but that smith is a stubborn one. He will not close shop for any... He's already... Oh, never mind. Of course, the bar over there has been shut down as well. We're pretty thorough when we need to be, you know. Not that anyone would want to go drinking at a time like this, but just in case. Maybe the back room is unlocked now. Who is it? You? A poor soldier is with you, too? Well, in that case, it can't be helped. Just wait right there. I'll unlock it for you. Oh? Norris was a good choice. Cool. What's up? You're going from the left side. Oh? Um, hi there. We meet again. I've never met this man in my life. And again. Okay, fine. What the fuck ever. There's Karsh. All right, cool. It's been a while, Lynx. Or is it Surge? It's Surge. That poor scumbag's with you? <sighs> well, as long as you're here, you're one of us. You, stay put and listen to what we gotta say. I guess he's talking to Norris. After we fought you guys, we also entered Fort Dragonia. Uh-oh. General! You're... Loading? Oh, bye. He disappeared? Damn! General! This is bad. General! Are you alright? Uh, uh, Riddell. Uh. I'll just stand there and help the general. Yeah, like, use a healing element or something. I cannot believe this would happen to the general. I, c I can't believe it. What in Dragoon's name happened here? So, like, what are all these tiny or shiny shards? Not now. We have to stop the bleeding. Marcy, you pick up those broken pieces. Oh, of the, uh, the dragons here. We brought the general to Hermit's hideaway and prayed for his recovery. He was able to escape death, but he still needs rest. However, we can't leave the manor for too long. So we came back here, leaving Marcy behind to take care of him, only to find... The poor military had taken control of Termina. Damn it. What a shame. Well, it's more than a shame. It's a literal tragedy, dude. It's like, uh, fuck it. Because of them pores. What do you got to say to that? I, too, question the methods the military has taken. That is why I'm acting in line with Sir Lynx. Huh. And don't you dare get in my way. God damn it. Hang on. Water is important. Ah, here we go. We knew what was going on. The general talks in his sleep. Lynx is behind this. Correct. Um, that bastard. He's not gonna get away with this. 
we've got some fault in all this, so we gotta do something about it. But first, we gotta rescue Lady Riddell. She's being held captive at the manor, which the poor military has converted into their headquarters. Hey, with your uniform, you can enter undetected, right? Let's join forces for the time being. It's not too late to go after him. One of us will remain here to collect info. The other will enter the manor. Let us meet afterwards. Oh yeah, the shards in the ground must have been pieces of the dragon tier. We've gathered as many as possible, but we don't have any use for them. You can have them. It's a tier of hate. Nice. Who do we want to join? Uh, we'll take Karsh with us. Everybody's yellow. Just fuck it. Every oh, wait. Karsh is green. Okay. Goodbye, Sneff. Fuck off. I just... I love... I love Zoa. <laughs> it's just so fun. All right. Um, Sneff. All right, yeah. Alright, traps first. There we go. Sonia and the carnivore. Now an eight. Infoscope. Fuck yeah, infoscope. You get heal all there and heal all there, and you get a heal here, and a heal there, everywhere a healy heal, um, healing, also you get a recover all, attack, nothing with hell in the name, not because I care about that kind of thing, but just because it is boring. Like, here's an attack that'll just automatically kill somebody. You know, have fun. Like, no. No. We'll go minus one on Photon Beam. Um. Magma Bomb. Inferno. Yeah. Yeah, screw it. There we go. These are good for changing the uh, the color scheme around a little bit. And what's level two household? Yeah, yeah, gravity blow. We'll do. There we go. What are we at? We're at one hour. All right, Karsh, let's see, you have a silver axe, a mithril mail. Give you a mithril helmet. Um, hmm. Silver loop, why not? Let's go check out what elements are in the shop. <clears throat> Be careful. Mm -hmm. 
Welcome. Alright, we have a shit ton of money. Do you have any traps for sale? No. Is there anything that I'm particularly low on? No, 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 no. Okay. And... If we had Van with us, we could go and check out other Van. That's not necessary. Um, what else, what else, what else? Here we go. Something's gonna happen. Oh, it's other Norris. And bring this boy Surge to me as soon as you find him. Yes, sir. Why, Sir Lynx? Sir Lynx, where have you been all this time? We heard that you headed to Fort Dragonia with the General. Exactly what happened back there? There have been many strange occurrences since then. Perhaps you know of a boy named Surge? Go? The man behind you is Akashia Dragoon Deva Karsh! You didn't... You didn't even... You... Sir Lynx, you are in the middle of taking him into custody, sir? Oh? Uh, you are... me? What is going on? Let's just say I am another you and leave it at that. Pardon me for saying this, but it appears that both of us need to look at the big picture. We will only have a limited understanding by staying in the same place. But silence! This is weird! Commander Norris, there is an urgent message from command. Uh, yeah, get me the fuck out of here. What is it? Um, sir, it is a level 2 security message. Go ahead, take no heed. This man is one of us. Yes, sir. Grobic has just arrived at the manor, sir. Hmm, he is quite ahead of schedule. Understood, I will return ASAP. ASAP. Yes, sir. <laughs> sir Lynx, forgive me, but I must return to the manor at once. Please come to the manor a little later. We will discuss this in more detail there. I'll still leave my doppelganger behind, because that's creepy. Alright, so, um... We managed to make some more weird shit happen. And, uh... Nothing wrong with that. Uh, everybody's at full health, everybody's over 300. So... Uh, many visitors are checking anyone suspicious. I'm suspicious. Are you gonna check me? Oh wait, no, we made a we made a choice. There we go. There we go. Oh, it's a Glen. Nice. Anyways, thank y'all for watching. Um, yeah. So uh, we got to go back to Viper Manor, and this time it's gonna be full of these fuckers instead of the Akashia Dragoons, and that's okay. I I don't discriminate when I murder, and I don't believe anybody else should either. Um. But yeah, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this one, and I will see you again tomorrow night for more Chrono Cross, the Radical Dreamers edition. And until then, I hope you have a good one.